Greetings in the name of Imperial Majesty Ja Rastafari, King Selassie I, the first Emperor of Ethiopia, Ja and King. Zai Emmanuel the Vegan again, once again bringing you a dish for today. So I'm fasting, I've been fasting from 9 o'clock in the evening last night and I'm fasting to 9 o'clock in the evening tonight. I do this on a monthly basis for health reasons and for meditational reasons and just being grateful for food, which we should all be grateful for food. Anyhow, I'm going to be breaking the fast with a soup because it's definitely soup weather now. So the soup is going to be cauliflower and potato soup with dumplings. So as usual, I'll take you over to the ingredients, take you through the method, preparation, cooking, and then show you it in a bowl at the end. Ja, Rastafari. So we've got some garlic in that box there, cauliflower there, some potatoes there, a couple of tomatoes, an onion, some flour for the dumplings, some mixed herbs for the dumplings, um, also some thyme for the soup, a vegan stock cube there, and some Japanese miso paste for the soup. Okay, so I've got some palm oil in this pot here, and I'm going to fry the onions, garlic, and tomatoes in there as a base, and then add some clean water and the rest of the vegetables which have now been peeled, washed and are ready. Okay, so the onions, garlic and tomatoes are fried, so I'm going to add some clean water now, which I've just boiled, and then bring you back in. So the clean water's gone in, and I've put the half potatoes in there, and I'm going to bring that to the boil now. Got some flour in the bowl there, which I'm going to mix with some water, and some mixed herbs and a little bit of all-purpose seasoning for the dumplings. The soup's boiling now, so I'm going to add some condiments. So I'm going to add a tablespoonful of thyme and three quarters of a tablespoonful of miso paste. I'm just going to mix up in there. And I've got a vegan stock cube here, which I'm going to crumble in. So I still haven't put the cauliflower in because I don't want the cauliflower to turn to mush. And the potatoes will take longer to cook than the cauliflower, so that's always a risk. So I'm going to be putting that in a bit later. The potatoes are par cooked now, so the dough's ready for the dumplings, which I'm going to roll into little balls. And I'm also going to add the cauliflower, which has been washed here. Okay, so that's the dumplings, the cauliflower in, and I've also added a scotch bonnet pepper there. So I'm just going to add a little bit, bit more water just to cover the dumplings, and then just let that simmer away. And I'll show you it when it's ready, and then in my bowl for my breakfast, Jack, that's the bar. Okay, so the soup's more or less ready now. I'm going to turn it off now and it will just stew by itself because I will be warming it up again later at nine when I break my fast. So here's the finished soup. Potato cauliflower soup with dumplings. Um, cost of this one, about four pounds, is easily three good portions in there of which I'm going to wax off one now. So there's the soup and I'm having it with a beetroot leaf salad and I'm breaking fast my monthly 24 hour fast so even more thanks to the Most High Ja Rastafari for the, in the inspiration, the strength Ja 